You're looking at the input display for my 12 volt inverter right here. The AC input uh, coming from the wall is showing up as 120 volts. <coughs> 60 hertz exactly. And if we scale back a little bit here, we can see that we're actually adding 19 amps into the battery with these settings here. And this is another AC watt meter. We're currently pulling 336 watts into the system at 119.1 volts. And there's the current amps that it's consuming, and then there's the low and the high values because we're plugged into the wall. Now we're going to go ahead and plug into this Krieger 12 volt inverter. Currently it's reading, uh, if I can get that on camera. Fourteen point five volts. And we're gonna go ahead and plug it in. Because it shows no watts. You can see we're at twenty-five watts. Thirty. Hundred and thirty six, two seventy three, now we're showing three hundred and nine watts. All right, interesting. You figured it would be as high as before. Now, on this display right here. We're actually showing only 205 watts, 93 volts going into the system that's unacceptably low, 2 amps, so 207 watts, and we see here that we're actually only reading 97 volts as well. And then you see here that the inputting current is actually only giving, giving us 13 amps. And that's purely because our incoming voltage is so low that it's screwing up the entire system and not giving us the right values. So now I'm just going to go ahead and take this thing here and unplug it. And you can see it's reading 318 watts right now. But that's definitely not going into the system. And as soon as I plug that in... We got 120 volts solid. And now it's starting to charge. So we see that our meter is at 19 amps. And our wattage is at 336. So the issue is actually this meter right here, not sending out the proper power. And in case we're wondering, we actually have, have it hooked up to two deep cycle batteries that are currently being charged in boost mode. So there is definitely not an issue with the amp draw on this. And this is brand new from the box. So just figured I would share that as I was having a really difficult time trying to determine why my power numbers were not correct. And this is the issue right here.